Hey y'all, as requested, I'll make another video on how I achieve this hairstyle. I do have a photo shoot today, so let me show you what I did. These are the different gels that I use. Eco got to be some braiding gel. Um, there's some edge wax and spray. I don't use all of them. I just use like two of them because it slicks my 4C hair down. This is the half wig. It has four combs in it, three on the top, one on the bottom. This is the ponytail. It has two combs in it and a piece of hair there to cover up the band. Now I'm sticking the, um, the combs in here. You can do leave out with this wig. I chose not to. I'll show you how I cover up the, the bump there uh, in a few seconds. And I'm just sticking them in and um, then put it in the back and pull the drawstring to tighten it. And then I got my ponytail, I stick those combs in and then just wrap that thing around. And then I um, pin the, the hair piece, the one that's wrapped around, I pin it or you can just tuck it in just depending on how, you know, how tightly you do it. Um, in this case, I did hair pin it. The hair can take heat, but I kind of like the kinky texture, kinky straight texture of it because it matches how my hair is once it's, you know, slicked down and everything. So I chose to leave that alone. And then what I do is I take some hair from the back of the ponytail and from the top of the wig to cover the band. And that way I don't have to worry about any leave out and all that because the way my hair is, as soon as I walk outside, the thing will be all drawn up and uh, the shrinkage is real over here, okay? Um, and this is the oil sheen, just some olive oil oil sheen that I just sprayed on and give a nice little shiny finish look. And then again, the final look and I'm ready for my photo shoot, bye.